chose you because you were special. Hit like and subscribe for more Halo Infinite, baby! Woo! I knew we would be perfect yeah. together. Yeah. And I was right. Oh my god. What time is now? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's happening. What's going on, guys? Welcome back. This is the reaction video for... Uh, the Halo Infinite, hopefully, E3 presentation that they show here. Currently, the internet's not working, so we're trying to get that sorted. This is my friend Jeremy, who's troubleshooting currently, uh, and we're both gonna watch this and react to it if we could ever get it to work. Okay, we got it to work on Twitch. Mixer just straight up doesn't work here. We launched Xbox 18 years ago with a game reviewers called the definitive oh reason my God. to own an Xbox. Well, because humanity was and is worth oh saving. Oh my God. Oh my God, it's Next happening. Holiday, we will launch Project Scarlet with Halo. <laughs> Sorry. Holy shit, Michael, shut up. Shut up. He's listening. Can you say hi? Hi. And how big are you? How big are you? Can you tell Daddy how big you are? Are you so big? So big. <laughs> and can you sing? <laughs> Good singing. How about I miss you? Miss you. And I love you. I love you. I love you, Daddy. I love you, Daddy. And I can't wait to see you. Can you say see you? See you. Okay, then. Bye bye. This is UNSC Pelican Echo 216. Can you hear me? This is UNS. Cells are fried. Armor shut down. Triggering survival mode. I'm going to try to override. Okay. You can hear me in there. I hope you're ready. Please don't die. Please. Did he hook up the pelican Where to his reactor to? in his armor? Probably. I rerouted what little power I had into your suit. Yeah. Hmm. 
Looks like there's a problem with the servos on your hands. Stay calm. You've been out there a while. I know I saw something in here to check your armor's diagnostics. there big guy you're not status report status report what there's something you need to see chief we lost lost everything there's nothing left for us here. I don't think we're here is. No, 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 no. Not then. Not again. We need to run. No. We need a fight. Oh my god, his helmet looks so good. Get ready. Go, dude. Oh, that's so sick. Oh my god, there's more. What oh, shit is in the control room? I chose you because you were special. I knew we would be perfect together. I was right. No, is that all we get? No. I mean, it's a year and a half away. <laughs> I can't respond. No. Anyways, that is our reaction to the Halo Infinite um, Deliver. Sorry, not Deliver. Discover <laughs> Hope trailer. Discover Hope trailer. That was interesting. So it looks like we got. Um, dude, I look all official here. I got like my little like field. Yeah. <laughs> So it looks like we got uh, introduced to a new character, the uh, the pilot. I don't think I caught his name. Uh, I don't think they showed. I don't think they revealed. Yeah, I don't think they revealed his name, um, which is cool. Always like to see new characters. It's like Halo's been missing a little bit of a personal vibe for a while. Like I like the the bit of like you know him calling or like him having a little hologram of his family that he has to remember them, and like because he thinks he's gonna die and stuff. And like I don't know. It was just it's just it was a cool vibe that I just haven't seen in Halo for a while. And um, brings it a little back to earth, a little more yeah, grounded. Yeah, to remind yeah. you what this is all for, you know. Yeah. So that was cool. Um, and uh, and yeah, and then we saw like when Chief like put the uh, the little AI chip in his in his helmet. He uh, it said what did it say again? It was like weapon. It said uh, weapon containment chip. Weapon containment chip. Something like so. That. So it's like kind of keeps consistent with you know the Spartans being considered weapons, and Cortana is like. A thing to like the main reason she exists is for his mental health and like it says weapon containment maybe that's what that's alluding to i'm not entirely sure but just when he put the chip in his head it was like weapon containment unit referring to cortana like no ai so that was interesting but um so i'm a little bit disappointed that we didn't see gameplay but i understand why we didn't because it is uh at the end of the day it is launching holiday 2020 so that is a long ass time from now. And so lots of stuff can change gameplay wise. So maybe they weren't quite ready yet. I don't know. It seems like, I mean, considering they they made a brand new engine for this whole thing, even though they have had extra time to make this game, you know, over like a year overdue at this point for, in terms of like the, the production cycle for the Halo games, you know, they did have to make a, a whole new engine from scratch. So, yeah, I mean, they honestly did that only a year behind is pretty impressive. Yeah, an I think it's engine. a year, something like that. Yeah. yeah. Um, so I completely understand why we didn't see gameplay there. I am a little disappointed, but yeah, it is what it is. I know we'll see more like, you know, in the coming uh, coming months. And uh, we do have a bit of news uh, from like a long time ago uh, that they said that like every new Halo game from now on will have uh, a beta of some kind or like a pre-release uh, play test, open play test of some kind, just so that they can nail down, you know, bugs and test out features and stuff like that because I think the Halo 5, you know, love it or hate it in terms of the multiplayer. I think that the multiplayer beta was really helpful for like really ironing out a lot of bugs and issues and things like that because it was a, the Halo 5 beta 
It came out a year out from launch. Based on that track record, uh, I'd imagine that we'd start getting like public flighting tests for Halo Infinite at some point, maybe in early 2020, um, around there. Nothing's confirmed yet on that front, but uh, yeah, we shall see. That was a cool trailer. I did really like the vibe. Uh, we just watched it again, cause like our outro from before the camera stopped working. Um, so I just got a chance to watch it again and I like it a lot more the second time watching it. I didn't not like it first time, but like watching it again, I'm like, I'm liking it even more, despite being a little bit disappointed that we didn't get gameplay. I get it. I get it. I'm still disappointed. <laughs> I really want to see infinite gameplay. Cause like, oh my God, the slip space engine looks so nice. Looks damn good. It does look really good. Looks damn good. It looks stylized to a very minimal degree. It looks like smooth. Yeah, it kind of looks like Halo 3 in a way. Mm -hmm. um, but in like, you know, just a modern context, I guess, which, uh, yeah, looks damn good. So anyways, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed uh, that little reaction video. Just wanted to record it because I feel like I haven't done one of those, like a proper one for like a new Halo release before. So I want to do a reaction video for E3. So anyways, we're very lucky that the camera caught the tail end of that first one. Thank you so much for watching. As always, guys, I'm going to do probably a more in-depth review, uh, not review or just you know, video talking about this trailer and then the article that uh, 343 have posted about this trailer and the slip space engine. Probably going to do that tomorrow. So uh, stay tuned for that. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. We're signing out from the Paris suburbs. See ya. <laughs>